Hey guys, I did some more testing on the uh, Green Time controller, the 350 watt. Um, default voltage is 48. I got up to 80 volts and it works. And it doesn't even heat up. Even the single cap doesn't even heat up. So, which is a surprise. Um, usually, I like to mod out the resistor on the inside for the. Um, this has high voltage protection as long as well as low voltage protection. Um, when you bring it up above 48 volts, it won't work at all. Okay, so um, I'll show you in the video attached video here. You can see the three power resistors there. The red wire going to that cap. It, and it goes up, and then there's three resistors there in a row. They're attached to that IC, which I've never seen before in a controller. And I'm, I don't want to mess with it, because if I do, I can pretty much destroy the controller. I'm not too sure what it does. And I'll probably look it up and see what it does. But uh, as you can see, it's, uh, I'll probably end up, I would end up messing around with those three resistors, this, uh, surface mount resistors that are in series there. But I'm not going to bother. Okay, so what I did is I just basically basically just ran the one thin red wire and I uh, center tapped it to the 48 volt on the on the battery and then ran the batteries in a series with a thick one and the ground to make it 80 volts and it worked fine so so that works um, some other issues I found on it now let's see here the next attached video there really bad soldering job on some of the wiring on the inside I'll have to beef up the traces also as you can see that one I am not too sure what was going on with that it's got a lot of flex and junk on it looks like it was still hot and I moved it and it just sort of slipped out of the hole uh, as you can see everybody solder jobs in this. They, I think they've had problems with this controller because it, it, it's got really piss poor soldering. Um, there's no real beefing up of the traces. They got a really thin wire through there. I'm not too sure why. It's not going to do anything. But uh, the soldering on this one is pretty poor at best. The other one's good though. So I'm happy with that. So that's about it guys. I figured I'd share that. And uh, hopefully you can use it.